This is my fiance and I's Christmas tree this Christmas. And this is our Christmas tree after Lego Santa came a few days early to deliver the content, baby. Yeah, we've got over 75 Lego themed presents all up in here to open up for ourselves. It is going to be absolutely insane. If you guys enjoy, please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe with notifications on, and stay tuned to figure out what the giveaway is in this video because we're going to be giving away some of these presents to you guys and how to enter on in. Let's get to opening some Christmas presents. All right, boys, let's start tucking into what Santa brought us today. Now, some of this stuff is uh, stuff that I purchased during Black Friday. Oh, okay, right off the rip, we do have ourselves a nice little clone trooper command station. I love these. Yeah, so some of this stuff is stuff I bought on Black Friday. Other stuff is things that friends sent to me, as well as some stuff that some companies sent to me as well. And it looks like we have a Battle Brick LCVP Higgins boat for a video that I have coming up should be pretty exciting. All right, let's tuck into this one. This one is a bit heavier. Now, everything is Lego themed. I actually think I know what this one is. Uh, this, oh yeah, the Lego minifigure, a visual history. I really like this. Uh, my grandma actually got this for me for Christmas, so <laughs> she knew I started a Lego channel. This is gorgeous. I'm excited to tuck into this. I love the little exclusive space man. This, uh, this wrapping job was not very good. This was me. <laughs> some of the wrapping was done by Zelda, some was done by me. Huge shout out to my fiance Zelda, the living legend. And we have ourselves a Lego Humvee from Brick Mania. The Snoopy wrapping paper, always fitting for Christmas. And in this one, we have ourselves a Snow Trooper Battle Pack. I actually bought a number of these around Black Friday. I love these Snow Troopers. I think they're the best Snow Troopers Lego has ever printed. So we might see a few more of these. Let's get into a wee little present, shall we? All right, let's see what we got in here. It's a little bag inside of a bag. And oh, these are some pieces that I purchased from David Hall, AKA Solid Brick Studios. You might've seen these in a short actually. Captain Rex right there, Commander Blah right there, and Commander Wolf. He also included, it looks like, a few custom helmets and weapons. That's pretty sick. This next one is in a little, is a little cute baby Yoda bag. Uh, skirt, ooh. Okay, we have ourselves Trouble on Tatooine, Mandalorian, and Baba Yaba. It's Baba Yaba right there. I feel like this set really could have used a couple more Tusken Raiders in it, but still, pretty dope set. Let's crack on with some Llama Party wrapping paper. Oh! <laughs> I told you there'd be more snow trooper sets. This is gonna be awesome because we're gonna be able to build a lot of snow troopers. You know what? I think it's time we go for one of the ones in the background. It's gonna be at the very top of the background there. We've got our Nintendo wrapping paper. Oh, another Mandalorian set. Uh, we got Lukey Pookie here and a bunch of those dark troopers attacking. I'm always shocked that these dark troopers aren't more expensive, but I guess you get a bunch of them in a single set here, so makes sense that they're not too pricey. You know what? I think this is going to be the first one that we are going to toss into the giveaway pile. So all you got to do is hit the like button, subscribe with notifications on, and comment down below what you want for Christmas this year. Stay tuned to see what else is going to be going into the giveaway pile for you guys. We just did a big one. Why don't we do a little small one here? Another little burlap sack we got. Oh, okay. Zelda got us a bunch of these little minifigure 23s. Okay. I think 24 just came out or it is coming out. And it looks like we have Popcorn Boy. Not too bad. I think I, I would have preferred the, the Sea Captain. But hey, Popcorn Boy is not bad. There's definitely worse ones you can get from Series 23. Shout out to Zelda. This is awesome. All right, let's go. I want another big one from the top. I want to be able to eventually see our Christmas tree here. Oh, that tape is tough. Oh, okay. We got ourselves a Lego AAT right here. I believe this set is retiring this year. You get a Soka, a 332nd Trooper, and a couple of those Kashyyyk Troopers for the droids. Really weird how they show the Kashyyyk Troopers and then they're not on Kashyyyk. I think they're on like Ryloth or something like that. All right, let's open up this brown manila one. This is like how my grandparents used to wrap things. They used to wrap them in like just brown paper or they would wrap them in newspaper. 
It was actually kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. I liked it. Oh! What is this? It's Batman! Okay, we got uh, Lego Batman and the Riddler here. I like that dude as Batman. The Twilight dude. I can't remember his name though. Alright, let's go for some kitty cat wrapping paper. The reveal, another command station here. Okay, this was another one that was on back order on lego.com for a while, so I bought a bunch of these for Black Friday, so I think Zelda might have wrapped a bunch of them in here. That'd be cool to find more of those. You know what? This one right here is shaped kind of like a command station. Yup, it's a command station. I'm digging the llama wrapping paper train that we're on. Oh! It's another Snowtrooper Battle Pack. Okay, we are on a chain of repeats now. Let's grab a big boy off the... Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay, I'll get that later. Let's grab a big boy off the top here. Oh! Okay. This is a Lego City set, actually. It's three different stunt bikers. And it comes with a free Lego travel case, so you can travel wherever you want with your Legos. Let's toss this one into the giveaway as well. This is gonna be giveaway item numero dos. This next one should be interesting. I think this is actually the Easter basket Zelda had this year. Um, let's see what's in this one. Oh, oh, okay. All right, I knew DK was actually sending me something, and I see his logo there on a card. So this is from him. DK Collectibles, huge shout out to my boy DK. You can see all of his socials right there. He's a legend, go check him out. Link in the description below. Seriously, if you want great deals on Lego products, go to DKCollectibles.com. What do we got in here? Okay, so we have a number, a number of Old Republic Troopers. What the heck? Dude, that's so many Old Republic, dude. Oh, and then finally, uh, we've got actually, this is that guy from from that Old Republic cinematic on Alderaan. That's so cool. I think, is he a custom figure or is this an actual Lego figure? I have no idea. Well, it's an actual Lego torso. It might just be custom printed on. I just counted, that is 20 Old Republic troopers plus the Old Republic commander. That's pretty sick from DK Collectibles. Shout out to my mans. Thank you so much, dude. That's awesome. Let's rip into this square Baby Yoda one now. Oh, this set. I've actually given away two of these sets in the past. I've never built one myself, but it is like one of the worst reviewed Lego sets of the year. Of all time, even. It's so expensive for what it is. All right, we have another battle pack shaped Snoopy box, and that is exactly what it is. Is this the third or the fourth Snow Trooper battle pack? I'm not entirely sure. If it's the fourth, then we're looking at 16 minifigs. God, I love battle packs. All right, let's do another mini, mini sack now. Let's do a mini sack. All right, we got, oh, this is interesting. Okay, I actually bought this on Black Friday for a discount. This is a Venom figure. Now, Venom is a store, it's actually called Venom Paintball. It's very interesting. And they make custom 3D printed Lego minifigure accessories, armor, and stuff like that. And this is a Mandalorian trooper here, which is custom painted to be like, forest camouflage that is incredible and normally they come in gray and you paint them yourselves but um, I ordered this one to be custom painted it looks like he also included a few extras we have ourselves a really sick modern camo rifle with an ACOG hey a Santa Claus Mandalorian head and finally actually that looks like a jetpack it won't fit on him but I'm sure it fits on other Lego figures. That's pretty sick. And then I just realized actually, the jetpack is magnetic. That is so cool. You know what, that was such a good mini gift. Let's go into another one right here. Oh, a little Lego poly bag. Oh, this is one of the Lego VIP poly bags actually. You get these from ordering Lego stuff from thelegostore.com if you're a VIP member. Uh, and recently on Black Friday, I ordered some Lego stuff and 
they sent me a bunch of freebies, so um, I guess Zelda included this one in here, uh, which is pretty cool. Did you know there's 16 frogs in one of these poly bags? 16! All right, I, I'm thinking this might be another command station. It is indeed. And this one might be another snow trooper pack. It is not! Oh, okay. This is actually another Battle Bricks pack. This is a Lego Willy's Jeep, which is pretty cool. You got the 50 cal up there, you got your US soldier right there. Play with honor, baby. This one might be a snow trooper battle pack. I I think we ran out of wrapping paper. Oh my god, what a shock! It was a snow trooper battle pack all along! Oh my god! Oh gee, I just ripped it. Oh jeez. Alright, how about we tuck into this long boy right here. This puppy is long and Star Wars. Yes, that is exactly how I would describe the Imperial Armored Marauder. Long and Star Wars. Okay, I think this is a command station. It is. How many command stations do we have here? Well, we got in this one. Oh, another uh, Series 23. Thank you, Zelda. Okay. It's the turkey. Gobble, gobble, mother. This is once again looking very battle pack sized. Oh, it's not though. Oh! It is a battle brick mortar team. Nice. Okay, so you get a mortar, some custom sandbags. Uh, an equipment box as well as two US soldiers right there. That's pretty nice. I think it's time for another big one. We got the kitty cat wrapping paper. Oh, oh, I see the quaft. Minecraft. It's the bunny. <laughs> uh, I hate this Minecraft set. It's so stupid. Yeah, that's enough said. You know what? Why don't we give this one away? This one's going out to you guys. I don't want it in my collection. Another petite bag. Let us see what we have inside. Oh, another series 23. Voila. Un nutcracker. This one is wrapped in a box. And, oh. Er, that's not a box, that's a bag. I am très stupide today. This is actually a bundle of phase one clone troopers. I ordered these a long time ago off of Bricklink from Germany. And if you didn't know, if you order from Bricklink from foreign countries, they tend to be a lot cheaper than the US. However, you do have to pay international shipping. And on top of that, it takes ages to get here. I think there's like 15 or so of them in here. All right, do we have another classy Christmas Santa? Oh, okay, we've got some brick heads here. I myself have never been the biggest fan of brick heads, uh, but I think these ones are kind of cool. I like Yoda and I like the Mandalorian, so um, this one's pretty nice. Overall, brick heads, not my favorite. This one's looking like a command station. It is. This one's looking like a snow trooper pack. Alright, let's do a mini one. Let's do a little, little boy one. Oh, what is this? Blocks brick mock. Okay. okay. What is this? It's like Republic colors. Okay. Well, that's a mystery set. We're gonna do a series of little ones. I just, I, I feel like I, I, we got these. Um, oh, wow. That is a lot of Clone Army Customs ARF Trooper helmets. Next up, we have another one of these. You know what? Instead of opening this one, this one's going to you guys. Added to the giveaway. And another one. All right, we'll, get, we'll do some more giveaway ones. There you go. It's in the pile. How about this one? Add it to the giveaway. Let's do it. Three to the giveaway. All right. Are we going to go four for four? If it's one of those, we'll add it. It is! All right, there you go. This is gonna be a big giveaway. Okay, next up we've got a little golden wrapping sleeve. What is in the golden ticket? 
Oh, okay, <laughs> that's kind of random. Uh, this is a Mace Windu. I think this is from the, the Republic Fighter Tank, is it not? I think that's this version. That's pretty cool. Another petite one. Oh, a fifth one. Oh, it's a major whammy. It's the fairy knight person. I don't really want to put it together. It's so many pieces. Let's get another present going. All right, this is, we are, we are deep in this thing. We're cruising, cruising, we're grooving, and we're getting another snowtrooper battle pack. I like to see those. This one is looking a whole awful lot like a command station. Oh my god, it's not. Hold up, what is this? Oh, okay, so this is one of the Spider-Verse ones. Okay, uh, this is Spider-Pig, naturally. Spider-Man. That is like Venom Iron Man? I didn't know that's a thing, that's so cool. And then Venom himself. All right, this is a bit of a bigger Baby Yoda package. Oh, it's another Minecraft one. Oh, hey, this one's actually pretty good. This is a, a villager trading outpost, right? Oh no, it's a bakery. Oh, another bigger package. Come on, big money, no whammies. Oh, another Minecraft. Minecraft packages are always kind of big. This one is a trading post, okay. Mini time. This time around, we have got ourselves, oh, a series of Clone Army Customs helmets right there. Some 501st. Isn't that like hard case or something? Uh, we got a captain. There's some variety in here. All right, we got two more of these mini little sleeves here. The first one is going to have, a, there's a bag inside of a bag. Oh, okay. These are nice figures. Yo, that is a clone trooper second airborne figure. Looks like in really nice condition too. And inside the golden packet here, we have, oh, it's um Moff Gideon right there with his Darksaber. It's so lame how they made the Darksaber just a, that. All right, this one's a bit small. What do we got? Another battle brick, and it's a 57 millimeter AT gun right there. You get the US Trooper, you get the AT gun, it's very nice. We gotta go through a bunch of these real quick. Let's do it. Number one. Okay, it's not a command station, but it is an Infinity Saga Guardians of the Galaxy Thor mix. Okay, number two. We have ourselves another one of these boys. Number three, we have ourselves another one of these boys. Number four, I don't think it's one of those boys. What do we have here? Oh my god, it's a huge lot of clone army customs, clone troopers for another video that I purchased recently. Okay, number five. Come on, let's go. Ah. Okay, it says CAC on the front. I think that's clone army customs. Oh my god, yes, it is. Oh my, oh, whoops, I dropped a bunch of stuff on the ground. Bunch of different clone army customs uh, minifigures, apparently. Okay, next up, we have ourselves. Oh, okay, we're gonna slow down for this one. This one is a little bit fragile. I think I showed this off in a video a really long time ago, but this is my copy, sealed copy, of the Star Wars Lego. Episode 2, Original Trilogy. I really want to get this graded because it's sealed, it's in nice condition. I love this thing. And then we've got ourselves, oh, more Clone Army Customs helmets right here. Lots of cack in this speed run. That sounded wrong. Speed run over, let's get into some kitten presents. Oh, another Mandalorian style set. Uh, this one is the Armorer with Paz Vizsla, the Armorer and the Mandalorian. I feel like a lot of these figures are gonna be worth a lot in the future. Okay, this could easily be a command station. Although the last few times we were fooled, but not this time. And this might be the twofer. It is indeed. Okay, another fiber bag. Oh, okay, this is a bunch of Clone Army Customs. Uh, pauldrons and stuff. All right, we got another smaller case here. This one feels very sturdy. I think I know what it is. Oh yeah, this is actually gonna be another video game. Okay, this is the collector's edition of uh, the Skywalker Saga for Nintendo Switch. If you guys have one of these, sealed or not, these are really rare actually. If you can find them in stores, pick them up. This is a great collector's item. Okay, mini bag. 
Oh! Oh, it's a little uh, Creator Poly bag. It looks like a little holiday train. I like that. I have a series of three itty bitty ones. I have a feeling they're probably all gonna be minifigures, but let's find out. Oh, oh, Zelda put up my uh, VIP chain. Oh, that's so cute, Oh, uh, Yeah, you get this for being a VIP member. Then we have ourselves the green Poly bag. What is in here? Oh, it's a little modern uh, soldier, JTAC soldier right there. Nice. And finally, number three. Oh. It's just a random bundle of battle droids. Okay. And we have a little bag right here, which is filled with, um, oh. These are Harry Potter, old school Harry Potter minifigures that I was going to do a video on soon. I'm afraid we're at the point where we have to start tearing into our background here. A command station? Yup. <laughs> Wait, hold up. If we get the command station plus battle pack combo. We don't really. Well, we do, kind of. It is a battle pack, but it is not the command station. Or the snow trooper battle pack. This is the droids battle pack. The very first droid battle pack right here came with a ton of figures. I wish they'd just remake this set, man. It's such a good set. This one might be the snow troopers. And it is indeed. That might be the last snow trooper we see for this video. Come over here. Let's see what you are. Oh, we got one of the Kenobis. I've actually given away one of these in a giveaway. This one is the other one that's for my personal connection. Connection. Collection. Uh, I just really like Kenobi Starfighter. I don't think this is a great investment piece or anything like that, but it's just a cool set I like a lot. Oh, it's actually a second one of these Marauder sets. That's not a bad duplicate to get right there. No siree, that's pretty sick. Oh my god, I just love that mortar trooper. All right, let's do the last of the the cat packs. And this one, oh, okay. This one's actually a really cool one. This is a retired Lord of the Rings set. Uh, this is the Council of Elrond. And you get a lot of good Lord of the Rings figures in here. It's just a very pretty and beautiful set overall, too. There's something different about Lord of the Rings Lego sets. They just hit so nicely. They're just so beautifully made. Right, we have to move our Christmas tree. Let's put our little figures around the Christmas tree. What have we got inside here? Oh! This is an advent calendar, I think. Yeah, Guardians of the Galaxy Holiday Special. It's, yeah, it is an advent calendar. That looks nice. You get a lot of good figures in there. Okay. All right, the final present. The last one. Those ones back there are our, our actual Christmas presents that Zelda and I are exchanging for ourselves. All right, this one's ripped a little bit, it seems, but I do see Spider-Man. All right, it is going to be... Oh! A very large an inch whoa, 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 Christmas tree <laughs> all right it is a large Lego spider-man set who you get Peter Parker casual you get gold spider-man you get venomy spider-man you get amazing spider-man you get venom right there you get a lot of figures in this uh, oh and the the green goblin wow this is a whole set man nice and thus the presents under the Christmas tree a gun. But that was really fun to open all those up. Some of those were a surprise to me, some were less of a surprise, but oh, it's just really, really fun to see. A big holiday thank you to all of you guys and all of our channel members, including the newest channel member, Amber Baca. If you guys want a shout out in every video through this big ol' set here, become a channel member. It also just helps out the channel a ton. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one and have a great Christmas, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content and hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.